Hello everyone. If you want to create science images or diagram just like professionals, so this video is just for you. In this video, I'm going to explain that how you can use a very important software that is bio render by using this bio render software you can create science images or diagram that just look like professional so how you can use it so it will be clear in this video so just to use bio render open your browser and search for the software that is bio render software now this is the main website that is biorender.com just click here as you click here so this is the home page of this bio render these are some options in order to use this buyer render you have to sign up in this buyer render so if you have already signed so you can click this sign in otherwise for the first time user you have to click this option that is sign up free and as you click here so it will show you a, a form upon filling that form you will got registered this time i am just going to click sign in option because i have already a id on this software so just i am signing in now this is the you can say this is the home page or after signed in when you will sign into this software so this home page will be visible to you now how can you create a specific science image by using this software so first of all in order to create a science image just go to this option create new click here and it will ask you that whether you want to create illustration a diagram or a poster form so like for example i'm going this illustration option so now this is the working sheet this sheet which is loading so this is the working sheet in this sheet you can make your image now how can you draw the diagram here or how you can make a you can say more effective image so for this this left hand side there are certain inbuilt options like for example if you want to use a some specific type of cell so in this option cell type just click here it will show you the other option like epithelial cells generic cells immune and blood cells so just click on the this on that option like for example i am clicking on this immune blood cells now it will show me all the diagrams related to immune and blood cell like for example this is the basophil and these are some grouped icons and this is like for example this is the dendritic cell so now just click here and drag that image to this working sheet and it will be here so this is the dendritic cell which i just dragged from here to here you can also change its size by moving this image like this just click these corners and just drag by which you can change their size now other options are there like if you want to see other options so for this just click icon again now in this column proteins you will find the structures of proteins like as i clicked on protein so here you will find about antibodies now just i click so these are the structure of antibody you can choose either of them like for example i'm going to choose this one so just click and again drag so it will be here now by this you can also add some pre-built templated so these are the template so here you will find some pre-built template you can also use them in this column there are the brushes means if you want to use a specific brush so you can use them also so here these are the options you can also upload your image to this software in this option these are certain drawing options like if you want to insert a line or arrow just click here and choose the type of arrow which you want like for example i'm going to choose this one so just click here now you can see now the cursor is just changed to this plus sign now just press your left click on the mouse and drag just like as you work in the powerpoint so here you can work similar to that one and just release so now this is the arrow you can change its color from here you can change transparencies its color width and many options are there you can use them so similarly you can just place your cursor here and move it anywhere you want like for example just for example i'm showing you 
this diagram so like this now here this option insert shape so if you click here you will see many shapes auto shapes which you, you can use for your image these are arrows in the custom season custom option now here in this insert text if you click insert text so you can insert text anywhere here just click here and now drag and just type whatever you want so it will be written there like for example i am writing antibody so by this way you can write within your image just drag it and place where you want to place it in this column you can change its font these are the fonts which are available for this particular text just click here this is the size just you can make it bigger or smaller this option is of color option just click here and you can choose the color according to your choice and these are certain other option like the alignment of text vertical alignment the style the bullet etc so these option you can try this option that is canvas size in this option you can choose the size of this working sheet if you click here you will see some option that which canvas size you want to use so now as i click here so you can see the custom size width and height which is in the inches so you can change this according to your need or you can choose some pre built canvas size like 16 by 9 10 by 7 like for example i am going to choose 16 by 9 so now the canvas is in 16 by 9 aspect ratio just click apply and it will be applied to your diagram you can also change the background of this working sheet or canvas just by clicking here and you can pick any color according to your choice and the color will be color of this background will be changed so by this way you can use this render tool and create images you can say images just like professional there are lots of option if you see in this section i just explain one and two but you can explore by yourself there are lots of option like in case of nucleic acid you will find the structure of nucleic acid like in the dna dna with nucleotide dna mini string etc as you click here so you will find out the structures of related to this dna so you can use either of them whenever you want to go back just click icons and you will be in this layout so here this is human anatomy if you click here so you will find the diagram related to dentals digestive system like for the digestive system you can see these are the diagram which are related to digestive system so if you want to make a image on the digestive system so you can use either of them so similarly there are other option like lab and objects where you will find the object which are generally present in the lab about species membrane cell structure epithelium so many more are there and you can also use as i uh, earlier tell told you can use this template these are pre formed template which you can also use so by this way you can create a attractive or creative image once you create the image just if you want to save it so just click this export button as you click this export button now it will ask you for the saving options or exported options so here you can change the file format either you want to image in a png format or jpg whatever you want so just choose that one and in this this is the resolution so you can also change the resolution by clicking here and just click this export button as you click export button so your file will be downloaded to your system like like you can clearly see this is the file which is just downloaded to my system so you can see that file so now the file is opening so this is that file just i draw for a you can say for a demo purpose in this this biomark will be this sorry this watermark will be there because we are using the free version of this software if you want to remove this watermark so you have to purchase it otherwise you have your images with this watermark because we are using the free version of this bio render in free version there are lots of option you can use them so by this way you can create creative or professional like images or particularly the science images by using this bio render software so that's all for today guys uh, see you in the next video thank you very much